Welcome back, guys, to part 17 of the Truman Challenge. Oh my god, stuff has happened. The first thing, Truman finally finished his school project, and we put him in out another one. Our trees and plants have grown. It is spring now, but there's an issue. This here is a problem. So um, I'm going to insert some clips right here of what you missed. Y'all, I just wanted to let you know that our little Truman here is a bear now. <laughs> Yes, so that isn't he cute. He's a little avocado bear. Guys, I just looked away for a few minutes. Everybody was chatting. Things were fine. And now Meryl is dying of laughter. Like, um, I don't know what to do with this. This is going to change the way that the challenge has to go. Because if the mom dies, the dad can't leave the family. So, I guess we're just going to have to do it that way. That'll still knock us down to just one parent, even though I had plans for, you know, dad to, you know, move out with Liberty and mom was getting with this guy. They were doing pretty well. Oh, goodness. I wonder if we can bring her back to life. We could always try a wishing well, but in my experience, they're not that promising. But it's like, it's the only thing that we reasonably can do because um, yeah, nobody here has got the like cooking skills and stuff to make ambrosia, so yeah, we're going to have to try the well. Oh, yeah, you want to leave the activity now? I bet you do. Poor guy, now he's so sad. Oh, gosh. Um, you actually need to use it. I'm going to go ahead and save here. Because I'm going to take the dad out here to the wishing well. And if he somehow dies, too, we're in a real pickle. This was supposed to be off camera time, just to get there a few days, work on everybody's friendships, the boring stuff. Oh no, all this time and nothing serious and then this mess. Oh, gosh, poor baby, why don't you come in here and go potty? Dad, you can actually use the bathroom too. And then we'll go out to the wishing well. He could probably stand to have a little nappy nap. Grim, you can go. You don't have to hang out. Okay. We have to make an offering of $5,000. Because obviously... I hope we can wish her back to life this way. Otherwise, we're going to wait for her to come out. And add her ghost to the family. <laughs> I wonder if we can have a ghost as the parent in the household. I don't think we can. Okay, he's cool with it. What can we do? Make a wish. Oh no. None of this is what we need. Let's just, let's just leave it alone. We're going to have to get her to come out and wish for her own life. This poor random child. Oh gosh. Yeah, goodbye. What are y'all doing? What's he got? Oh, his clay. Our poor guy. Oh. oh, 
everyone's devastated. Oh, no. All right, well, I'll get back with you when I figure out what to do about this. Okay, we've added her back to our family, and now we're going to take her over here and make another $5,000 offering, and then we're going to try and wish for life. Everyone cross your fingers, because this is crazy. We've given this wishing well $10,000. It better work. Wish for life. Please, wishing well, bring me back to life. I didn't mean to laugh to death. <gasps> Is it working? Um, something appears to have wrong. Mara was enveloped with gleaming light. She had failed herself passing back to the realm of mortals. But when suddenly, bam, dead once again. No! What What are you doing? It's too late. You need to come in here. Come in the house. Can you get some food of your own? Yes, you can. Get leftovers. Great. Well, crap. Well, I guess you might as well invite him in. I wonder... If we can become a vampire, if that'll bring us back to life. I mean, it's worth a shot. Take a selfie with Vlad. Even though he did break in and suck our blood a while back. This challenge has really gone awry. <laughs> Make a move. Ha! Vanilla pimp the door. Vanilla pimp the door. All right. Again, I will come back when I. I'm in a position to see what we can do. All right, like, so, you know, so, um, it is Saturday now. The plan is to try and get Truman to work up his best friendship with Billy, because we need to complete that before he ages up, and we're going to try and get her to wish in the wishing well again now that I have been feeding it. I have put in about $30,000 over the past few days in this well, and I'm about to give it another five, and we better come back to life. Wrong person. All right, come on, Meryl. Get over here. Put in another 5,000 buckaroos. I did try the whole getting Vlad to try and turn her to see if maybe that would turn her back into a human, well, a live vampire. But no such luck, I couldn't even ask. Make a wish, wish for life. Cross your fingers again. Darn it, he's getting angry. Why is this so difficult? Who's this rando walking by like we're not doing nothing? <gasps> I think it's working. Something appears to have gone wrong. No! <laughs> no! We're going to keep wishing in this well. Because um, we've only got like two weeks until Truman Age is up. Um, right here. Yeah. So we don't have long. We're going to keep wishing in the well. We're going to try different amounts of money. We're going to figure it out. Um, and if we can't figure it out, we're going to try... To move the dad out and leave the ghost adult as an adult. I don't know if it'll work or not. But uh, Google didn't have any answers. So that's where we're at. She has work in three hours. He has work in nine. 
Uh, Truman appears to be getting in the tub. Um, Raphael's fine. So, I guess after Truman gets out of the tub... Oh, man, if they both go to work... Well, no, they'll, they'll overlap. After he gets out of the tub, we're going to invite Billy over and socialize. We've got to get her up to best friend status. And we don't get to hang out much pretty much on weekends. Uh, yes. And Billy aged up to a teen, but I figure that's okay, because Truman is the one who's a child, and she was a child when they started out. So, it'll be okay. What is broken? Uh, excuse me, sir. Can you come in here and repair this? Oh, we get these kids to talk. He's all in the bushes. Get out the bushes. <laughs> she is so much taller. Share them secret. Where are you going? Tea some tea. Horn swaggle, whatever that means. We're gonna do it. Oh, it's a mischief interaction. Ah, you don't drink tea. Get over here. She's like, I don't want to be around y'all. Come away from me. Go to work. Uh, yeah, hurry up and eat so you can go to work. Baby is fine. He's on the potty. Well, heck, he can eat her leftovers. Oh, did we hurt her feelings? I'm sorry. I did not mean to do that. I don't know what a horn swaggle is, but I won't do it no more. We're getting close. Gotta get him up to the best friends. He's been best friends with his mom this whole time. <laughs> Sharing them sacreds. Arrgh. Yobi Hobi. Yobi He's talking about being in his pants. Smooth. Come on. We're almost there. Not horn swaggling. Ask where the blend wind blows. I uh, hope that's not rude. Oh my. Lily Livered. We should be able to. We're looking pretty full. Can we become best friends yet? How about some typing tips? Uh, become best friends. <laughs> Truman Burbank and Billy Jang are becoming best friends. Perfect. He's not best friends with his mom anymore. That's okay. Get you some leftovers, little bud. He's fine. Um, somebody, please, can can you just control your children? Discipline this booger. Tell him not to do that. And then clean it up. What does he need? Nothing. He's fine. She's angry at work. 
He's fine too. Well, who's this? Dina Caliente. Let's invite her in. What's up? Oh, hoi, me matey. Man, you've been mopping that rug a long time. Hey, girl. What you doing here? I don't know you. Do I? Nope. Let's introduce ourselves. And shiver our timbers. Oh, hold up. Mm. Give her a pep talk. Shaba shoe canoe. Compliment mighty fine garb. The girl, I really like the way that shirt accentuates your boobies. <laughs> She's like, ah. I'm gonna go take your trash out. <laughs> what kind of madness. Oh, that's hilarious. I'm gonna do some push ups real quick, get a bulk up before she comes back in. Mm. Amazing. He's like, look, girl, I work out. Oh, oh, don't bother her. Crap, she was cleaning up. Now you can clean it up. I <laughs> didn't even know that was there. I should have assumed. Um, then we'll hit bumper. Where are you going, little Trumi? You want to talk to her? Oh, no. You're just going to dance. Dance with the baby. She's like, excuse me. I need to get through here. Give you a pickup line. Who's this? Kirk Blackburn? Who are you? Ahoy, me, matey. Come on in. Let me introduce myself. <coughs> Who are all these people coming over? Is it because my wife is a dead celebrity? Ex-wife. And I don't know him either. And... <laughs> Interesting. Well, oh, time for work. <laughs> and she's home. She is hungry. Get you some leftovers. And you might as well introduce yourself to these people. A vast there villain. <laughs> oh, I mean, matey. <coughs> introduce. Introduce. How you doing there, Billy? Damn, I ain't even met her. Who's this? Kennedy Alonzo? Well, girl, come on in. We're just collecting them up, apparently. We'll introduce ourselves to you, too. Who are these people? Sally Mixon? Do you want to come in, too? Oh, you're leaving. What are you doing, little baby? You can come and use your little potty, and then we'll set out some food for you. I don't know why that get leftovers button is there, because he doesn't do it. There we go, and then grab a serving after. Don't you dare take that. You want to take the trash out too? Why does everybody like taking out our trash? It stinks. <laughs> Thank you. Sherman needs to go to the bathroom, but I can't help him with that. Ah, she's gonna go take a nap. She didn't even finish eating. Get in here. Eat this food. I don't care that you're an angry ghost. Oh, you're... What? Who is this? 
He's got different hair, maybe? Come in, boyfriend. No, that's the same hair. She's like, hey. Yeah, there's a bunch of randos here, I know. I don't know what's happening. They just kept coming over. And so I just kept inviting them in. Get over here and eat this gosh darn chicken. You cooked it. There. Oh! Honor among thieves! Kirk will lose reputation and be fired from his job if we escape the loop. No! We're going to save the crew! Alright, what a beautiful little family! They always eat dinner on the couch because the baby cannot get up to the bar. <laughs> Not that there's enough place for all four of them. I don't know why she's like electrocuting. She didn't die from electrocution. Hurry up. Oh. He's out there working on that good boy. Baby's fine. Yep, she's gonna have to go to sleep. So she gets done eating. She's done eating. She needs to go to sleep. Bunk down. This girl in here playing with his clay. Matter of fact, when the baby gets done eating, I think we'll put him to bed too. He's done. Come on in here, little boy, and bunk down. Truman, you've got to deal with yourself. I wish I could help you. What are you doing? Are you going to let Vlad in? Of course you are. You better not be here to feed on nobody. I don't think he can, though. Oh, yeah. Vlad and Marilyn are pretty strong lovers, too, now. Ah, <laughs> They sure do like talking about trash. And cupcakes and airplanes. He's like, yeah, I know me too. Well, bye. <laughs> Dad's home. Dad can come and put Truman to bed. Um, and then use the toilet. And then grab a leftover for himself. Do that, buddies. Oh, tuck your baby in. And mom's up. <laughs> Let's see what I can do with her. She's mostly okay. Let's have her pop a real quick shower. Free the salty brine. What does that mean? Yeah, do that and then you can come over here and paint. I know how much you like it. <laughs> Haunting. Alright, he's gonna eat and then we'll put him to bed. Excellent. Everybody is doing what they need to. Perfect. Alright, Dad, hit the hay. I'll clean this up for you. When she finishes this painting, we might go see about putting another offering in the wishing well. Alright, beautiful. Let's get that sold. And come on out back. Make an offering. Let's try 1000 this time. See if he prefers smaller amounts of money. Because we have put a lot of money in here. Sell it, okay. I don't know why they think we just want to collect up a bunch of masterpieces. And he's a green a glowing. What's going to happen if we ask? Wish for life. Come on. Oh, it's green. He's not looking quite so angry. I think it might be work. No? 
Oh, he gave her ingredients for ambrosia. I don't even think she can make ambrosia. Uh, what is this? Potion of youth? We don't need that. Where is this ambrosia? What is this? It's not telling me. What is it? It is not what we needed, and I do not know how to make ambrosia. Nor does she have the cooking skill to do it. That's pretty annoying. So I guess we'll end this part here. And hopefully we can get her alive in the next part. Because if not, we're going to try some shit. Um, Alright, I'll see y'all guys later. Bye-bye.